Hello, and welcome to Ride the City. I'm going to uh, show you a bit about Ride the City and then talk to you for a couple minutes about how to edit OpenStreetMap. Ride the City is a bike routing application. You can click and drag uh, start and st stop icons to the map, and Ride the City will generate a bike route for you. Ooh, there it is. Uh, in some cases, um, there may not be bike lanes or bike paths uh, that appear on the map because nobody has edited the map yet. They haven't uh, uploaded the data to, to the map. Um, so I'm going to show you how you yourself can do that. I'm going to just zoom into some part of the, the map, the city where I uh, don't see any bike lanes, uh, like over here. You can just right click anywhere on the map and hit Edit Map in OpenStreetMap. What happens is it will reroute you to OpenStreetMap. Since I'm logged in already, it takes me directly to the map, and uh, here it is. If I, I can click on this line here, and it says that it's 83rd Street. It's a residential road. Uh, there's a lot of different information here. Here it shows that it's a one-way street. Let's say that uh, this here is a bike path. It doesn't look like it is. It looks like it's a dirt road, but let's assume it's a bike path, and you want to um, add um, the line to, to show that it's a, a bike path. So you can just start clicking on the map here. I'm drawing a line. Let's see, it curves around here. I can move up a little bit. And let's just say it goes over here and connects to this road. So I'm going to move my point over until uh, that little blue point shows shows up. And I'm going to double click <clears throat> to finish the line because you want it to connect to that street. And there you go, you've drawn your line. Now you have to show, uh, you have to qualify what type of a, a, a segment it is. And, and here it's not a road, it's actually a path. So we're going to show that it's a cycle path. And there it appears as a dotted blue line. So I just added a new bike path. See how easy that was? Um, if I knew that it connected to this street here, I could um, do a shift click on this node and it would basically start the line again. And I can just drag it up to here, and again, when that street uh, appears uh, blue, the blue dots, and I double-click there, and it, it's connected to, to that street. And again, I can come uh, down to define the type of a street it is, and I go to Paths, Cycle Path, and there it is. I can uh, click on this here path, and I can even name it here. We'll call it the 83rd Street Path. Under miscellaneous, I could even show that the source is Bing. This is the Bing aerial image that I'm basing it off of. And, you know, there's other data that you can add as well. But that's the most important part, showing it in the real world and connecting it to the streets. And then you just hit Save, and it would uh, be uh, saved into OpenStreetMap. And eventually it would appear on the map here as a green line, which would be your new path. That's how easy it is to edit OpenStreetMap. And we hope that you give it a, a shot and uh, add any bike paths or bike lanes that are in your neighborhood. Thanks.